disruptive sort of thing to kind of uh, you know piggyback off the back of the news that Louis Vuitton are looking for a new um, menswear director is this really tasteless article courtesy of Hypebeast and this is typical of Hypebeast and again I'm speaking from experience because I used to work for Hypebeast a very long time ago this is like a what was that what was I say did you say disclaimer or whatever it may be I worked for them very very long time ago when they first started out and they were kind of like evolving from the blog spot into like a proper website I kind of was doing a little bit of work for them you know writing some articles doing some pieces here and there did some street style pieces I read some articles here and there, but I wasn't there for too long. But I, I could say I was definitely one of the first few writers that they had when they were there. And the, the common thing that they always kind of done back in the day was, you know, a lot of their articles and pieces weren't really that heavily well researched. They weren't that well written. And they just generally sometimes, you know, fell on the side of being a little bit tasteless when it came to certain things that they kind of covered. And usually if people complained enough, they would kind of end up taking them down. And I feel like this article is probably one of the same. So what it features is this kind of weird kind of of street fighter game type design thing they got here where they've got select your designer select your fighter and it's got martin rose telfar clemens and grace wells bonner now i think this is in poor taste because of the nature of Virgil's passing it's not as if Virgil was sacked or fired from the Louis Vuitton job it's not as if he moved to another role because he was kind of you know he'd done what he wanted to do at Louis Vuitton he went to go elsewhere this was him kind of essentially passing away in tragic circumstances and him not having the ability to kind of finish the story or finish the journey that he started and a lot of people in fashion who were kind of very close to him felt very bad about his passing maybe because a lot of them didn't know that he was going through what he was going through so it really caught people off guard and it really kind of hit home, especially considering what he went through prior to his passing in terms of all the weird cancellation things that happened around Black Lives Matter and just in general, the lack of, I think, love that he maybe got from a lot of people that maybe looked like him in the industry, blah, 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 blah. I think when it did end up happening, I think it woke people up in terms of understanding, you know, you know, maybe trying to give people their flowers when they're around and stuff and the circles around it. You know what I'm talking about. So to kind of depict the next hunt for Le Vuitton's next menswear designer um, as some sort of like game is really classless, really tasteless and incredibly disrespectful. I feel like to Virgil's legacy and what he's doing. It really is gross. And it's not surprising like i said these platforms you know they just want clicks they just want virality they want kind of engagement they don't necessarily care about these individuals in the slightest and any kind of opportunity they can use to kind of game the system and kind of make it work for them they'll do it but i'm really disappointed to see this from high piece i really really am this is really really rotten to the core and i feel like doesn't necessarily represent at all what happened to Virgil or doesn't honor his legacy in the slightest and I can't really you know there's nothing more I can say about it that's going to be good so I'm going to kind of probably leave my words to myself but I think it's really really good and if some people are saying it here see horrible job on the image um but yeah some people I guess I'm not really too fond of it but yeah I, I hate it I've, I think it hate, I really hate it I don't like it in the slightest and I think they should probably take this down but again what do I know what do I know